Well, for years you've gone by this place. It's right here, and for years you've been here. And I'm telling you, this is Ronnie Mac. Uh, well, I, I call you Mac, of That's course. Good. It's, it's Anything Ronnie. but late for supper. There, there you go. Ronnie McCartney is his name, but of course he's the owner of Max Market. It's at the corner of Six and Old Thirty One, right here in La Paz, Indiana. And what a great shop you've got here. Great market and great product. And of course, Thank this you, is, I even got some of my garden here. My garden supplies came from here. And we'll show you that coming up in just a bit. But how long have you been here, Ronnie? My folks bought the property in the spring of 1951. Wow, and you've been here ever since. We've been here, one shaper's form. Now, have you ever had a chance to go home? Oh, it was home for many, many years. <laughs> yes, it was, I'm you sure know, it is. We lived above the building, or above the, the store building. Yeah, and you know what I like about this is you have a lot of fresh vegetables, a lot of fresh fruit. You've got meats, you've got cheeses, you've got all the stuff, but you've also got your own line of product back here behind us. You've got the salsas and the fruit salsas. Can you These touch are, on the fruit <clears> salsa? Uh, the fruit salsas I was not particularly impressed with when I was first told about them, but once I gave them a try, I became a very dedicated convert. It's, uh, it's a great product. We have uh, cherry and uh, peach and several different flavors yes. of fruit salsa. Well, this is the pineapple here. I've never tried the pineapple. I'm gonna have to grab some of that before I leave, but I've had the cherry before and it's really it's good. good. It really is really good. good. Yeah, so, and I know that, you know, you, you have your own private label. Um, oh, wow, I didn't even know you had this. You have the corn and pepper salsa. That's good stuff, they, too. They've got several varieties. Like I say, it's, it's made here in Marshall County. Yeah, and a lot of your stuff, you want to focus on the Hoosier brands, right? That's and correct. And that's what you've got. You've got pickles and just a little bit of everything. <clears throat> We've uh, just recently acquired the Crystal Springs milk uh, from Osceola, and it's been fabulous product for us and for our customers. Very very pleased clientele with the, the products that they offer. And that's it's, the different uh, flavors too, right? Yeah, it has different, they have strawberry, root beer, uh, cold coffee, uh, and whole milk, 2% skim milk. Chocolate is to die for. And that, that's also, if people are lactose intolerant, they can almost tolerate that, correct? The it's way a that's special made? process, it's done at the farm, and it's a lower temperature processing and a lot of people that are lactose intolerant can have this and use it regularly. We have several customers of that now it's, nature. It's pasteurized or, or not pasteurized, but homogenized? It's which? pasteurized and most of it is homogenized. Oh, they do have a, a label that is cream line yeah. and it is not homogenized. It's pasteurized, so it's safe, but it's not homogenized. The cream comes to the top you like the good shake old days. It. You gotta shake it, right? You yeah. gotta shake it. Either that or you get the cream off the top. There you go. And what, when are you guys open? We're open nine to, to seven, seven yeah. daily. Seven Every days day a week. except Christmas. There you go. And of course, Max Market, anytime you can get out here, uh, well, we wanna kinda take a walk around and show some of the stuff that's going on outside, but also, we're gonna be talking to your granddaughter, I think. Right? Yes. She's got some fireworks. <clears throat> My granddaughter and grandson are both in, in she's in high school, the grandson's in college, yeah. and uh, they have ventured into a, a serious fireworks a booming industry. program this summer <laughs> uh, for a variety of reasons, but yeah, it's part of his college fund, and uh, we're, we're working with them and working hard at getting uh, a clientele for their product, and they, they've go. got some very excellent product. Yeah, well, I'm gonna take a walk around the store here a little bit and take okay. a look at some of the product. We're gonna show some folks what we've got and uh, we might have to get a, go get some matches. The, Let's talk the about the meats, noodles. The meats come from uh, Grable, Indiana. It's, it's Grable Meats. Oh, yeah. And <clears throat> they are an excellent canned beef, canned chicken. There's also turkey. Oh yeah, you got the beef An chokes. instant meal if your if you're, company comes and you're not ready. You're ready. You That's just good to go. A, open a can of that meat. There's no bones or anything. It's all ready to go. Throw some noodles in, and in a half hour, you've got chicken and noodle or beef and noodle. There you go. To die for. Yeah. And you got the gravy mix ready to go, too. Yes, sir. Sticks to the ribs in, right? Right. Let's go down here, because I saw that you had pies, and then here's more of that grable meat right here, the chicken and turkey. and. Yes, sir. And you got a little bit of everything. You got chips, you got salsas, you got, oh, by the way, if you're going to be doing your garden next year, get your seeds. You can get them here. They've got tons of seeds here uh, for you. Bulk, wow. bulk seeds, and we have packet seeds, but the bulk seeds are our feature. We have corn, peas, and beans, and we start on our, our packets uh, from be beets to zucchini. Yeah, and that's where this is all, and it's all organized. It's easy to see. All right, let's look at this milk, because this milk that you guys have here, I was, oh, you've already got the watermelon cut for people. 
You know where you know where I put my spoon in that? Right in the heart. Right my, in the middle. My my mother was a very conservative lady, but uh, that was one thing she was liberal about. <laughs> the heart was hers. He didn't touch it. Dad and dad and the kids could have the rest of it, but the heart was mom's. <laughs> that was mom's she, right in the middle. That was concerned. You don't touch that. Okay, this is what I want to talk about. This is what you got to see. Where's the? This is the root beer one right here, right? Yes. Yes. This tastes like a root beer float, but it's milk. It's flavored milk, milk right? Milk base is flavored milk. <clears throat> I just, I just elevated. The one to the right there is heavy cream. This is the, this is the big cream one, right? This is where that's, the cream rises and you no, gotta, no, this oh. is regular. Oh, this that's is regular. true heavy cream. Oh, that's just cream. And that's pure cream. Okay. And the, uh, the white bottle on the bottom right there. One, that's, that's the cream line. And that's, if you look yeah, you real can close, see yep. you can see right here is the line of. There's cream, and here's your regular milk below it. So you gotta shake that up real good. If, if you want it shook up, you shake it. If you want to pour off the cream, you can have cream in your coffee. There you go. It's always a good thing. And where are these guys out of? Osceola, Indiana. Osceola. Okay, yeah. It's a local dairy. Right on Ash Road. It's done, yes sir, it's done. The processing is done there on the farm. Well, as always, come in, see Ronnie and the family. Well, we were able to hang out with Ronnie for a little bit, and now we've got Mackie. How you doing, Mackie? <laughs> Good, how are you? All right, well, you know what? I got to say this. I know this is your summer job, and you're going to be a senior at what high school? Harrison High School. Harrison High School, and that's down by Lafayette, correct? Yeah, West Lafayette. All right, so here's the deal. Your summer job, you've got this banging summer job. It's <laughs> booming. You're ready to go. And, of course, you're dealing with fireworks. Oh, yeah. How did this happen? <laughs> Okay, so... Because normally your grandpa's in here selling radishes yeah, and tomatoes yeah. and everything else. Now you're selling explosives. Great. Yeah, so my brother's always loved fireworks, and he had a summer internship that got canceled because of coronavirus. So my grandpa gave us the idea to do fireworks this summer. So my dad helped us find a wholesaler, and we went up, and we bought all the fireworks, and then we... Opened up set it store. all up and yeah, <laughs> yeah it's been exciting and now this is maniac max so uh, let's take a little tour i know that you've got quite a bit of stuff here yes but you've got you know by the way i love this it says california illegal in indiana that's just game on right <laughs> isn't that isn't that right yes well you've also got stuff from arkansas tennessee oklahoma yeah. so so yeah. these are 200 grams right here so these ones have a lot of different colors they'll have less shots than the 500 grams which are over here yeah so those are super pretty and then these are the 500 grams so these are they tend to have more shots and they have like a bigger display so those ones are pretty popular They're those go expensive. up too they go up yeah there, they right? go up a lot higher yeah oh look they've got yeah. they're, they're getting political here they're getting political yeah we got the political that's ones. good that adds more that adds more bang for the buck right yeah there you go uh, these ones are some more 500 grams, and then this is actually a fountain. The rest of the fountains are over there, but this is called Mount Everest, and it's called that because it goes 40 feet in the air. That goes 40 feet in that the air? That goes 40 feet in the air, okay, and it like builds up. We're going to set this one off to the side. Yeah, it builds up to 40 feet. I'm going to take this one. <laughs> I will get some before I leave, but this is great. Okay, what's the, okay, and then of course you get the bottle rockets yeah. and that kind of stuff. This is some of our fun stuff. So these. These are called sugar cookies. These are super loud. Super, everybody comes in and gets these. These are really cool. So they're like an M80 slash... Yeah, they're yeah, an M80, yeah. yeah. And then over here we have our artillery shells. So we have like 24 packs, 12 packs, 6 packs. So these ones are really popular and they go up. And they're kind of like the 500 grams. They're not in a sequence. Are these the ones so. you drop down into the thing? Yeah. Like a mortar? Yeah, okay. they're mortars. Yeah. Wow. And of course here's some of the bottle rockets and Roman candles yeah, and stuff. Yeah, rockets firecrackers, Roman candles, that's that. So because of your brother getting that done, you know, having that happen, you yeah. know, canceled internship, which was a paid internship. Right. You had to find something to do. Yeah. And, but you're the one here. Yeah, today, today. <laughs> that's awesome. We're normally here together. Well, once again, if you want to get some fireworks, get to Maniac Max, which is part of Max Market. Of course, Ronnie and the entire gang's down here, and of course, Mac, you'll be here, and they'll be happy to get you going, and that way you can wave your sparklers, and at the same time, light off some big boomers. So there you go. <laughs> Come see the big Kong back here. That one's the supposed to be the, the largest of the canister fireworks. So there you go. Right. Legally. Yeah. Legally. Legally. Yes. yes.